And now to the big story. The Kentucky Supreme Court ruled against last year's school choice law. They ruled that receiving tax credits for private school tuition support is illegal. LEX 18's Kristen Edwards has reaction from both sides in tonight's big story at five. Let's start with a refresher on what that 2021 school choice bill does. It would create a tax credit scholarship fund here in Kentucky. That money could then be used to let kids go to schools other than their local public schools. While the public school system might work great for a lot of families, it's not the right fit for everyone. And that's why Andrew Andover with Ed Choice says he's devastated by the Supreme Court's ruling. Unfortunately, this decision means that in the short term, there are kids that, that aren't going to get to the classroom that's going to work best for them. Meanwhile, the Kentucky Education Association is celebrating. This is not only a victory for our public schools, but for our students all across the Commonwealth. President Eddie Campbell says striking down school choice will allow the tax dollars that are raised for the purposes of public education in the state to be utilized for public education and not sent elsewhere. When we take those tax dollars, we're investing in those students every single day, which means we're investing in the future of the Commonwealth. Despite the ruling, Ed Choice believes this fight is not over. They expect the General Assembly to take school choice up again next session. KEA hopes instead they'll focus on improving our public schools. You can read the Supreme Court's full ruling online at lex18.com.